Our buddy Mark Benson, the athletic director at U Albany, with Armin in the back, 104.5, the team. Mark, happy holiday season to you. And, you know, this is where the, the students go home, but the hoops teams are still hooping it up. Tell us about the hoops holiday oh, season you goodness. got going, baby. Well, happy holidays, guys, uh, Thanks, to you as well. And, yeah, the students are gone. And, you know, this is my second winter here in the Capital Region. And, and based on last winter, when I think we had uh, – a foot of snow on the ground heading into this time of year. I was going to have a marketing slogan of you Albany basketball stuff. You come on in. It's warm inside, but since the weather's cooperating <laughs> with us right now, we just have to go in a little different direction, but um, we do have uh, our men's basketball team play St. Francis this weekend. And of course, coming off, uh, 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 we uh, uh, lost the Albany cup, unfortunately this past weekend, but a, a good, good game and, and great uh, attendance there. At the time, genius were looking at a shot of redemption, St. Francis of Pennsylvania. And since our students are gone and we want the community to be engaged as much as we can, we've got a special, our next five home games, we're doing a family four pack. So four tickets, four hot dogs and four drinks for $40. Ooh, so nice. We're excited to roll that out. It's nice. a lot of food. Yeah, well, and, and during the holiday season, too, it's great for, uh, you know, families to figure out what to do with everybody in town and everything else. So, yeah, What's everybody else going to eat? I've got the four hot dogs. Well, it is a classic uh, holiday staple, I'm told, in the Capital Region. The, the hot dog uh, is a big holiday favorite. Oh, nice. If we only had a taste testing opportunity here in studio, Mark. Uh, we can arrange that for you guys <laughs> Saturday night. If you're not busy, come on. We could be our celebrity. I mean, why not just? Take a taste test, and we can do a uh, see which one of you can down the most hot dogs in say forty seconds. Levac sucks because yeah, Le- Levac, Levac always talks a big game about like no, eating, that's not. What are you talking about? Eating and drinking, and then when it comes to the time, it doesn't I'm happen. I'm not a fast eater. Armin is the fat guy inside. I'm just a fat guy outside. And I won a cannoli eating contest. It's just the judges couldn't count, and they got it wrong, and they gave it to a nice, cute girl. Well, you know what we could do. It sounds like there's a potential for controversy. We could bring in uh, an impartial judge, maybe Doc Sowers. This, this is his 60th year with you, Albany. Yeah. Uh, he could come in and be a, a neutral party to, to put this uh, at rest once in all. Who can eat the most hot dogs in 40 seconds? 40 seconds is Armin. If you go like longer, I can I could trounce him over like 10 minutes. But in in 40 seconds, he would eat, he would eat me under the table. Well, let, so what about an intermediary? Since we're sticking with the four theme, four tickets, four dogs. What about four minutes? I I might stand a chance. All right, I, I'm down for whatever, oh. man. I'm I, I'm cool with it. <laughs> Armin's down you, for you, hot dogs. <laughs> you guys let me know, and we'll make it happen. And of course, Doc Sadler, an institution in college basketball, and and at U Albany for as long as he coached there. And my favorite Doc Sadler story is that oh, no. when you guys upset Stony Brook uh, mm-hmm. last year in the final home game of the year, I was sitting next to him, and I swear to you, I bear hugged him and I held him just like like he was my grandpa. Like yeah. I just wouldn't let him go. And he I had a bleep you look in his eyes that I, you have never seen before. I really enjoyed it i'm not really sure what he thought about it i think i mean i've heard him bring it up so it, it definitely made it, uh, an impression on him i'm not sure if it was the highlight of the 60 years but yeah. I, I guarantee you it's probably in the top 60 moments i would take that i would take top 60 moments mark benson the u albany athletic director with armin and levac hey uh, you guys have a great kids day coming up as well we got a lot of moms and dads listening to the show what do i do what do i do with my kids during the holiday season you got an event for us we do. Our, our women's basketball team, actually, actually this weekend, we've got, you only has this whole country covered from the East Coast to the West Coast. Our women are in the Women of Troy Classic, and that's not in the Capital Region, Troy. That's out on the West Coast in oh. Los Angeles, and they're taking on, that's we're taking on UC Davis uh, tonight. Uh, if we win, we will take on the winner of uh, USC, the Southern California and Florida A&M winner. So we're out there now, but when they get back, we play Yale uh, on the December 30th, and all kids under 12 will receive a free admission to the game with the purchase of an adult ticket. So uh, great, great chance for our families in the Capital Region to come out. Our women's basketball team, as you guys know, has uh, won four straight America's East Championships yeah. and off to another great year so far. Mark, Mark, I mean, when it comes to accolades for your athletic program, I feel like we have to bring up a new giant plus every week. This week, it's in the world of women's soccer. Yeah, we have uh, Vivian uh, Vega, who uh, was a member of the U-20 Mexican national team. Actually, it's kind of interesting. She, she, about three-quarters of the way through the season, received notification that she's going to be on the team. So she actually left the team uh, during the season. Uh, She is our 
widely consider our best player to go participate with the Mexican national team. Uh, and then they earned third place in, in the, uh, it's called the CONCA, I can't even pronounce it, CONICA Tournament in Honduras, but they, they will be in the 2016 Under-20 World Cup. So big honor for Vivian and, and really, I think, a great, great recognition of the, the growth of our women's soccer program. You Albany Athletic Director with Armin in the back. Mark, we love you. Love your family. Uh, send our love to them and the entire U Albany Athletics program. Proud of you guys for the direction you're headed, as always. And we'll do it again after Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas, guys. Love you guys. Happy holidays. Thanks.